everyone, welcome back. This is The Bet Knitter. So this week we are going to go back to unboxing. Um, as our monthly tradition is for our darn good yarn unboxing for October. I had to think about that for a little bit too long. Time kind of flies by, but if you haven't checked them out, I'll put a link in the description below so that way you can go see what they're all, all about. And let's go take a, take a look at what we got for this one. So we got first our yarn. Huh. Uh, let's see what it's called. Burgundy Blossom. Ooh. Again, I'll put the description of the yarn in uh, the description below in case anyone's interested. Um, it's uh, f fine yarn, fine too. 125 yards. Um, interesting. Very skinny yarn. Very thin, which is good. Um, so, very awesome. Good coloring for this. Uh, let's see what we have. Uh, let's see, homemade wooden sh uh, shawl pen. This is what it says on the cover. Ooh. I'm actually kind of... Oh, this is super cool. In case you guys are into making shawls, this is what we got as our extra this month. Um, this is actually very cool. As I make shawls, I can definitely include this as an accessory to one of the things that I make. Um, I must say I am very happy to get something like this because you don't really see it that often. Um, and like last month, if you guys remember and watched the video, uh, we got the needle gauge. So I'm glad to see that they're doing something kind of a little bit uh, different because we've gotten like a lot of buttons and stitch markers, which is cool, but um, this is stuff that you don't normally see um, in a lot of places. Um, so it's something very unique and very cool and something kind of special that you can add to your project. Um, because like for me, I don't use a lot of buttons, but this is something cool that I can kind of add to a project if I wanted to. Again, like since I use, do a lot of shawls, I can just kind of add this to a shawl, um, as a little extra to kind of, um, spruce it up. Not spruce it up, but like... Um, a little above and beyond, a little something extra because it has a nice little design on it. Um, pretty solid wooden too, so that way um, it doesn't feel flimsy or um, like it's gonna break. If you have to like kind of work it into it, it's not gonna break on you, which is good and what you want. Kind of like a nice solid piece of wood. So that's awesome. I'm glad to see something a little bit different that we're getting in our boxes. So. Um, yeah, if you guys have not checked out Darn Good Yarn boxes yet, um, I definitely suggest go look, um, go taking a look now. So of course we got our monthly booklet. Um, these are pretty cool because they usually give a rundown of the artisans uh, who are actually making the yarn, which is kind of cool because Darn Good Yarn is a little unique um, and where they get their yarn from. But also, do 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 do. Let's find the pattern. What pattern did we get? Uh, we got subtle cable boot cuffs. Um, so that that's the name of it. But also, kind of, that's what it looks like, which is interesting. I haven't really seen a pattern for this before, so um, I like having a lot of different special. And also, like with every month, do they do the knit pattern and then do the crochet pattern? So. Again, that's another cool thing is they do one of each, so that way both, doesn't matter if you crochet or knit, you can get a pattern every month. So that way, if you don't know what to make with your yarn, you at least have something to make. So uh, go check them out. Very happy with this month, and I will see you next week. Bye.